Thank you, Mr. Speaker. Uh, I, I don't pretend to know uh, all the life experiences, the perspectives, uh, the insights that, that, that the five ladies who uh, just talked eloquently did. I, I, I can't understand, begin to understand some of the hardships they faced in life. I don't want to minimize that. I don't want to in any way add to that. I don't want in any way uh, do anything that would compound that. But I, that's why I feel pretty good about Senate Bill 1978, because it doesn't do that. It's not a discriminatory bill. The language does not contain discrimination in it. In fact, as, as Representative Shaheen and I have talked about, I think it's actually a non-discrimination bill, making sure the government does not discriminate against you on the basis of uh, who you're associated with, who you're affiliated with. We have this fact pattern right in front of us with the Chick-fil-A situation uh, where the city of San Antonio said, because you donated to the Salvation Army, because you donated to the Fellowship of Christian Athletes, we're not doing business with you. That should alarm us all. And again, I don't care if you're Chick-fil-A, I don't care if you're Ben and Jerry's, we need to make sure that the government does not penalize you for who you associate with or donate to. Uh, and with that, Mr. Speaker, I move passage. Question occurs on the passage of Senate Bill 1978 to third reading. A record vote's been requested by Mr. Stickland. The clerk will please ring the bell. There being 79 eyes and 62 nays, Senate Bill 1978 is passed to third reading. 